Today we are going to learn how to give yourself a bra fitting for shopping for our bras here at Victoria's Attic. This of course is just a starting point. Generally it will give quite an accurate band size and sometimes we have to adjust the cup size depending on the size, shape and fullness of your chest. To start with your fitting it is good to ensure you have your best fitting bra on, preferably nothing with too much padding or push up. Try to have your straps adjusted so that you will have some lift on the bra you are currently wearing. This will give it a bit more of an accurate measurement. First, we are going to find out your band size. Simply measure in inches the width of your rib cage directly under the bust. Ensure that the measuring tape is even in the back with the front. It is very important as if you do not have it even, you will not get an accurate measurement. Once you get the measurement, you will use this as a guideline for your band size. If you measure 37 and a half inches around, round up to the nearest band size being a 38 band. You want your bra snug, but not uncomfortably tight. The snugness of your band is what gives you the majority of your support in a bra. The majority of support should not come from the straps on your shoulders. Now we are going to determine your cup size. Start by placing your measuring tape on the far left side where your breast starts. Then run your measuring tape to the same spot on the other side. Keep note of this measurement and then keep your one hand in the same spot on the left side and bring your measuring tape up and over the fullest part of your breast and back down to that same spot on the right side. This will give you a larger number than the first measurement. For every inch difference that you get between these numbers, you will go up in a cup size. For example, if the first measurement from side to side was 19, and then the second measurement when you went up and over the fullest part of your breast was 25, that would make a difference of six inches. So each inch is a cup size, starting from A cup and going up. So we would start with an F cup. So a 38F would be the perfect guideline to start with, given the measurements we have done. When you get your bra on, you want to ensure that your band is nice and snug, but not uncomfortable. When determining this, keep in mind, is it uncomfortable or is it just feeling snug like you're not used to it? You also want to pay attention to how it feels for snugness on the sides of your rib cage and when you sit down. Now when having a look at how your cup size is fitting, we need to do a few things. First, lean over and pull your breast forward. Your breast tissue starts underneath your arm, so you want to ensure that your entire breast is pulled forward and in the cup. Now once that is done, ensure you have snugged up your straps and now have a look at how your cup is fitting. You want to make sure that your breast is fully encased and that your breast is not overflowing from the cup. You also want to pay attention to the side where your underwire is hitting. If it is too far forward, then you will need a larger cup size to get your breast enveloped inside the cup. If it is too far back and digging under your armpit, you may need a smaller size or possibly a different style bra. Ensure that the back of your bra is not riding up and that the center of your bra is laying flat in between your breasts. Again, this is just a guideline and starting point. If you have any questions, refer to our charts and frequently ask questions on our website or feel free to contact us.